Hello YouTube, this is Grungluck here. Uh, <clears throat> I'm playing Rome 2, uh, Emperor Augustus DLC. Now we have, a uh, quite the inquiry. Some, some, in whose logbook would this be considered a close victory? Look at, look at my forces. Now look at their forces. Does that look like a close victory to you? I lost 700 people, they lost 3,000. And change. Six, seven hundred of which we captured. <laughs> um, so I'm a bit confused. Who this is very? It's very odd. So it's, it's a it's a close victory apparently. Um, what are we gonna do with these guys? We can loot them, not get much. We can subjugate them. That's such a crushing defeat. We can send 700 of their guys back to rebuild their army and and get a, and a puppet ally in the region. I think that's a fair trade. I think I'm okay with that. We just wanted to subdue the barbarian tribes. We're not interested in ruling this really remote land. I'm just trying to shore up my frontier here. That's what I'm doing. Oh, I have a job for you. Sit, go sit in this province. There, you go. there we go. Now, Mark Anthony can go on to do greater things than subduing the barbarians. What do they want to give us? They'll give us some slingers. No, thank you. Actually, that might be good. Um, nah. I don't want one unit of slingers. That's kind of pointless. We hunger for battle. Let's see here. Guess I'm. I don't want to force march him. I'm just gonna walk because he needs to recuperate his army. We hunger for battle. It's my chod army. My first chod army. Gonna get some more chod. Soldiering. It's a good life. It's another child army. What's this? Oh, it's one of my men. His flags look different over here. Uh, he was getting his artillery, which he had got. Ready for orders. I could say assuredly that he has artillery. So now he can, you know, force march his happy butt. Over here. At your command. This army can stay there for now. So we're gonna go on uh, to Babylon. I don't know what they've renamed it to. Whatever it is this time, certain the um, this area certainly does not belong to the the Parthians. That's for damn sure. We're gonna liberate it to its rightful owner, Mark Anthony. Let's do some let's see if there's some building. Uh, I don't think we need a practice field here in Pergamon. We can just go away. Shrine of Jupiter, that's always good. Let's need some more shrines of Jupiter. Jupiter should always be praised. Ah, uh, here we go. Another shrine of Jupiter needing upgrading. This is tax harvesting edict plus 4%, which is perfect because that's what I'm doing in this province. This, 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 uh, this particular god is more of reverence to the state of Rome in this respect. I always use better horses. Oh, that uh, cuts up a lot of the, uh, the 
other options because I guess that costs a lot of money. That's fine. I'll pay that price. We hunger for battle. I think we need to build another army, but not this turn. We need to do some more conquesting. And Mark Anthony needs to put his, his troops to use. Hmm. So we're gonna have some combat soon. I know we're five minutes in and no combat yet, but hold your horses. It's coming. It's, I positioned us at a key point in the game where a lot of stuff is gonna kick off very quickly. Okay, dignitary, okay, whatever. Uh, Libya loves my reign. How oh, wonderful. Uh, we had some factions that were destroyed. We built some stuff. Nice. Macedonia loves me as well. Wonderful. Uh, Achia, they love me. Okay, wonderful. Wonderful. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and get our spy. Doing what she does best, spying. She's just gonna march down here, see what kind of, what kind of enemy we face. Actually, yeah, that's what she's gonna do. Cause we're at war with these people, we don't want them to sneak attack our formation. We're gonna just march like a, like a respected gentleman to this bridge and stop. So that way our spy can come in next turn and figure out what's happening. Okay. Where's Mark Antony at? That's Equestrius. He's in charge of Equestrius. He's gonna, like, maybe chill for a bit in this province. His army's kind of beat up. A little bit of recovery. That'll do it some good. And we have this thing to activate as well. Wonderful. Good timing for our champion to show up, our veteran. So now this is no longer such a critical, like, juncture in between. This was the border. Now this is the border, <laughs> basically. Quite more of a, of a massive buffer that, that we are uh, guarding with uh, good men. Goodman guard it. So the barbarians will not be delving upon us so swiftly. They'll have to think again. Think again, barbarian scum. So we are Romans. You can't even build these bridges. We can just tear them down, build them in two weeks. See what happens. Okay, I think that is that is it for this turn. I'm just gonna go ahead and move this army up here. So you know what that's for. Ready for further orders. Um, and this is another one. I think we actually should build yes, we should build a uh, manipulator barracks here. That way, get some actual good troops. Good troops. Good troops. Okay. I don't think we want to backstab this one. We're not going to backstab Octavian right now. So this is more of an army for northern aggression. These tribes over here. But, however, we down here, battle. this lane is perfectly open to us because Lepidius is a traitor. Already he has aggressed. 
they're 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 fighting Lapidius because Lapidius declared war. So, so in my mind, this is this lane is open to me. I should actually be marching on it within the few, a few days, a few turns. Probably next turn, I'll be marching on it, and then maybe, I'll be declaring war. That's how these things work. You must march, and then you fight. Okay, let's see. Uh, Defender Pontus. Into war on side of ally. So this is not just some random person. Just declaring war on our you put my puppets. Another freaking... Uh, dark Deeds. A member of your family has been found guilty of poisoning his board to inherit the boy's lands. What would you have us do with them? Um, yeah, let's... The, the Tarpian Rock, I'm pretty sure, is the appropriate thing in this circumstance. Let's throw them from it. Yes, yeah, so we can subjugate man. another one of these. Wait, this one has this one has balls. Mark Anthony would need to do that. Huh? Do you want to do some more northern aggression, Mark Anthony? He can. He should probably just set out for the greater, greater fight. Okay, he's he's not gonna do anything for now. He's gonna chill. It's not it's not time for him to leave, but he's not gonna go north. Okay, so this one right here. Let's go ahead and march. Okay, there is a little army there. Okay, that looks great. Go ahead and oh no. They have a lot of troops up here. They have a lot of troops up there. Ready for battle. Advance. I'm gonna go to the next bridge. That's that's the prudent Make thing to do. Men. Go to the next bridge. There's a bridge you're standing at guarding, and then you're like, "Where should I go?" And you see another bridge. Then you should go to that next bridge. That's the way to do it. To the next bridge. Good job. Uh, my friend Decimius Alhaira. Decimius, my friend Decimius. Ready for orders. All right. Uh, this army, yeah, I'm gonna start marching it. It's gonna, it's almost gonna get there. It doesn't have to declare war until we're way up there, until we get around here. Then we have to declare war. We can enter his lands. I don't think we have any treaties with them. Let me make sure. No, we have nothing. Wonderful. Speak. Okay. Let's see, does anyone want to trade with me? Oh, Armenia wants to trade. Oh, wonderful. My master extends the most my good. I am. Anybody else? No. Okay. And they hate me. They are my puppet, so they have to do what I say. Do not attempt to sweeten truth with honey. Uh, he doesn't want to trade with me yet. He you will. He will eventually. All right. Oh, I have so much money. I didn't spend it. Oh no! It's such a bad thing. Not really. Doesn't matter. I'll just stock a war chest. It's fine. Oh, I need to build another army. That's what I need to do. So when you have a whole bunch of money, really the only thing is to make something that gives you significantly less money, which is a big army. Oh no, Pergamon has slums. Oh shit. Uh, another family. No. Uh, whoa. Who? Sextius Fronto. Okay, he's gonna get adopted. Yep. Okay, 
Sexiest front troll. He, they adopted him and he became their leader of the other houses. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, he's pretty good. I, I really wish they didn't adopt him. Where is his army? Because now I'm I'm vulnerable. Here it is. Oh, it's just Chad. He can have the army of Chad. That's fine. I don't even I don't even feel like yeah this we still need this army but it's not gonna pose a big, big threat. Oh, they their army left. Their army left. That's such a disgrace. That's such a disgrace. Okay, finally. 16 minutes in and there's action. <laughs> Ballista! I get to use my Loose. catapults again. I mean, these uh, ballista. Much more advanced than you would think someone would deploy regularly to the field instead of just like catapult. Just a basic plain Jane catapult. Now the Romans have to deploy ballista. That crushed lots of units. I always try to break the areas where there's a staircase. Well, that's, that's pretty effective.
race. Okay. Are you firing at will? I want you to do that. Uh, I want you to take out this wall. That's actually a really good wall to take out. It's right in our way. Oh, oh, it's just mob up there. Oh my god. <laughs> well, they're actually units. Not some plebeians that have decided to take up arms. Let's march the guys in. in the walls. I'm about to own these walls. We should make holes in them. Riders at the double! But we did anyway. Because why not? Some Eastern spearmen up there. Can use the 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 if they were in position. I mean, Palista! <laughs> Get him. They like walk right up on him. It's wonderful. Oh shit. That's not one. They don't like that their hoplite, their foot arches have been completely overwhelmed by my. Okay. I'm gonna run them out. Who's in front here? I need someone strong. I need the legionaries. Come on up. First cohort, two units behind them. Now well, we could do with some of this. They charge at us. There's the horse skirmishers. Advance at speed! 
such speed! An arrow tower killing my men unnecessarily. The Eastern Spearmen will be slowly picked off by their own arrow tower, which is converted to my side. These pathetic, pathetic Eastern Spearmen. Their running will not save them. I landed near it. They're defending the the arrow tower. It's funny.
Oh, he missed it. Good job. They used the last of their ammunition, but they demolished it. What a fine job they've done today. Huh. I guess I have to take their victory point, huh? That sucks. Go attacking to Studo. You know, it's not fair, the same unit, but. Oh well. Life's not fair. Life's not fair, Legionnaires. I don't think they're going to take many casualties as long as they stay to Studo. Oh, they lost one. Oh, they lost another one. Uh-oh, no, they're not going across the bridge. Thought they'd be smarter than this. Formation. That means going this way, you idiots. Oh, they could have gone under the bridge. Whatever. They did it. Oh, there's still... There's still some units here. Let's hit these guys. right here, I see. I guess it's not a very good defense when the tide is low. It's a nice river, though. It's running right through your capital. That mob is freaking out. They're like, oh my god, are we actually gonna fight? Oh my gosh. I didn't think this was actually going to happen. Come over there. They're cheering, but they're, they're screaming on the inside. You can see it right there. They got trapped. Oh, we got them. Nice. Oh, they've already broken. waver at the thought of fighting real men. They just wanted some easy kills. Wonderful. Wonderful. Alright. Well, that shall conclude another episode. Thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much. Goodbye.